Hey guys, Mr. Burns here, and I'm going to be taking you through a special case today of what happens when um, the exponent is zero. So, if we have, uh, say, the case we have right here, three to the zero, we get the answer one. Let's see if I have another case. Four to the zero, still one. Five to the zero, still one. Six to the zero, seven to the zero, eight to the zero, still one. And guys, if we keep going on forever. Anything to the exponent zero is one. So I'm actually going to write that rule out for you. Okay. Very important rule. Anything to the exponent zero is one. Okay. Anything to the exponent zero is one. That's a very, uh, fundamental concept of powers guys can't say how important that is and it can make your life so much easier when you have an exponent zero in a order of operations question um, so I got a couple examples here to sort of clarify things um, Bill Clinton to the power zero or, or to the exponent zero I should say I almost caught myself on that one one the beeps to the exponent zero one my personal favorite a dinosaur to the exponent zero still equal to one okay so anything to the exponent zero is one i can't say how important that is it's not zero it's one all right so just check out a few other examples here all righty so what happens when we have a negative base okay well negative one with the brackets around it so our base in this case is negative so negative one brackets to the exponent zero is still equal to one easy enough right well what's our base in this case okay our base in this case is not negative one it's one so this is my base right here one so one to the zero is still one but in fact what we have here is that one to the zero is one I can do that but my negative is still outside here okay so that's ne negative inside one so this one, in fact, is equal to negative 1. Okay, so uh, I know it sort of goes against what I said before, but not really because uh, the base is still 1. Okay, it's any exponent, anything to the exponent 0 is 1. Well, 1 to the 0 is 1, but there's no brackets here like this one. Okay, I think I have a couple more examples here. Uh, what is the value of each? So I got my brackets here, so negative uh negative 12 exponent 0 well that's going to be 1 because of my brackets well this one right here I have no brackets so 4 to the 0 is 1 but then my 4 outside so that's going to be negative 1 okay and this one I got brackets so negative 431 to the exponent 0 is 1 so guys I hope you start to see the importance of brackets and I showed it in my last video if you didn't see my last video on what is a power I suggest go back and look at that one because I give it a little bit more detail about the importance of brackets and explaining uh, what the base is if there's no brackets or if there is brackets. All right, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Check out more videos at uh, my website. Uh, see you in class.